Why are we here? Uh, because on uh, January the 12th uh, of this year, there was an episode that happened where a uh, person collapsed, I guess, in a cooler, and a worker actually found him and started ministering um, first aid to that person, CPR. And I would tell you it's very important to do so uh, because, you know, when somebody goes down and you don't know what's going on with them and you, you evaluate them, and then you figure out what's going on and you run that, that first care, that's always good because once our emergency workers get there, uh, I know the fire department got here, they started doing their thing, then EMS got here, started doing their thing. And so it's always helpful to get those, get, get it started. So today we're just here to, to want to honor some people for, for their what, what we call heroic acts. I know this is something that, that, that Richmond County and the fire department run into um, practically every day, or every day. But when you get citizens involved in doing something like this, uh, it, it's, it's very, very important to get them involved. All the angels around me, you know what I'm saying? I can't explain that like I want, you know what I'm saying? Just thanks God for everybody, you know what I'm saying? Yeah. And uh, I accept mostly every night. I like wake up, you know, like be crying, like, you know, I bless some ills, you know? So that's a good thing, you know? So I got a long ways to go now, you know what I'm saying? Thank y'all for being by my side. You know? I hope it don't happen to nobody else, nowhere else, you know what I'm saying? Hopefully everybody gets somebody on the job or something that knows stuff like that because he could happen to anybody, you know what I'm saying? So I just happen to have good people around me to take care of me at that time, you know what I'm saying? Thanks God for that, that's all I can say. It's very important to know CPR. I mean, every citizen should all, will want to take a course in, you know, how to do CPR because it's very important because the life you say it could be your family member, it could be someone else, your friends. So it's very important because you know it's important to get that if someone's heart start beating, if they are not breathing, it's important to get that circulation going back in their body, or whether it's a heartbeat, whether it's breathing, whatever the case may be. And that way you can you can save a life. And that's what it's all about. That's why it's very important to know CPR. And I encourage all citizens out there. You know, if you don't know CPR, go take the course. Go, go take the course. In this case here at Blue Marlin, it paid off for somebody to know CPR. Um, and like Ryan said in the beginning, we're all family here. We spend a lot of time here more than we do in our own family at home. Um, even though we're not going to be blood, we're still family. We're still family. Um, in that moment, uh, I was very thankful that the firefighters gave a quick response. They were here within three or four minutes, but in that moment, it felt like an eternity. But it was also a very, how everyone responded that morning um, was a very calming um, place. Just very thankful, very thankful that I was obviously put in that position to even try to look for him that morning. Most time, we're fixed to open up for service. It's a little after 11 o'clock, and we're fixed to open a restaurant. Um, and most of the time I just go right on to uh, Manning's in the kitchen, Manning's in the restaurant. Um, and that morning I stopped and paused and looked for him. Um, I'm just very thankful that I was put in a place from upstairs to, to look for him, to look for him that day.